Yes, sir. How are you? Guys, the same pattern. The same pattern with the demos. Wow, this is a big area. So, we are already legal. We already got our tags from the outfitter. So hopefully we can use one tomorrow. So we just uh, finished met our guide for the week. We're gonna go to the range now to take a couple of shots, make sure the gun's still side in, and tomorrow we're gonna start our hunt. Hi, my name is Martin Lachine. I'm a guide since 2002 in Anticosti Island. If we, uh, we have a... Uh... La Mer, it's the same. Yeah, you regroup. 60. You regroup. Yeah, that's good. good. That's good. That's good. That's good. You're all right. He's dead. Perfect. He's dead. This is normally the distance we're going to be shoot at. Yup. But about, yeah, maybe maybe a little more. That's what. Yeah. That's what. You got you got you got three hundred. Yeah, he's a three hundred. Yep. I may gonna click it up four clicks because mm -hmm. I don't know if I got bumped or not. Yep. And go from because I aim here, I should be up and he's in line with what I aim. So I'm gonna okay. go four clicks up and we should yep. be fine. Okay. So this is our first day here in Anticostal Island. We're just gonna meet our outfitter and we're gonna get going. Carlos, this is Hi, Carlos. Carlos, pleasure to meet you. Yep. Martin, good yes. morning. Good so morning. All ready, all set to go? Yes, yes. Beautiful. As soon as we're done, uh, we're gonna go and try to Perfect. get that big buck. Big buck, let's find it. That's a Chalo River. Chalo River. Nice, nice uh, place. So it shows where we are. Okay, there's a big sector here. We're at Sector Bilodo now. Okay. We're uh, our trail are B6. Okay. And we're gonna start right here. Take the ETV until we 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 find that little uh, street of water right gotcha, here. Gotcha. We'll stop that right there. And then and hunt we're from gonna there walk forward. and we're not gonna try on this side because the sea the, the, we're the gonna wind? E east wind and we're not gonna walk on this one. There's a little valley before that uh, swamp, so. Perfect. I'm gonna go and walk right there. Sounds like a plan. Yes. Let's do it. You, uh, there's no dust. You want him in the... So, this is our first day of the hunt. The guide, our guide Martin, just took us to this area. This area burned a couple of years ago. So we are just going along, playing the wind, see if we find some deer just eating along.
got it. My God, what a hunt. Martin. Just in case he stands up. Oh, he's down. Shot him right in the neck. Wait, wait. Wait, wait. Try the shot. Okay. Yes, I will. Woo! -hoo! Yes, man. Woo! -hoo! Martin, we got him. Three on the yards. He just dropped, man. Fast. Mark, that's over 300 yards. I need your helmet. Okay, take mine. Okay. Just put the helmet there. You focus on that one. Okay. okay. I think it's about 50 yards ahead. Let's go slowly in case he stands up. Put the scope always on minimal power. I'm so happy right now. This was one of the toughest hunt I ever been. Our guide, Martin, let me tell you, he's as good as they come. Hard worker and man's hunter, that's for sure. Uh, I'm so glad because of the weather, I didn't want to take a chance. We saw these four bucks on this little swampy area that he knew about. It was low pressure in here. And as luck have it, it was true. We came in, we did a rattling section, and there it was the buck right there. When the shot, when I shot, two more came from that side, and he came across. I asked Martin to do another rattling. He did, and one of them came back. And you know what? I took the shot, 300 yards, I felt confident. And man, he just dropped. Oh, let's check him out. I'm happy for you, my friend. Really happy. We work hard. Three we days. Did. We did. Three days. We never, never, never give up. <sighs> I'm so happy. This was a hunt, man. <laughs> this was a hunt. Like you said, these two bucks, yeah. Martin, they were bedding down down there. When they heard the shot, yeah. the two of them ran off. Okay. And when I told you to do it again, the yeah. rattling, one of them came back to check it out. I never saw those two ones. I only saw the one, the big one first. And then I told you, you, you... It was four of them. The one you saw here was yeah. not the same one. This is a different one. The other one is smaller. It was four bucks in here. Tell me something. What do you thought about this 300 yard shot? He dropped in his tracks. <laughs> that Damn was good. good shot. Let's go check him out? Yes, of Let's course. Let's check him out. I want to go with you. <laughs> I'm so glad for you. Oh. Doe, doe, right there, guys. That's the doe. She's... Wow. Yeah, like you say, there's no hunting pressure here, that's no, for sure. No, no, no. Let's go take a look at this. Nice. Oh, he has a big body, I tell you. Mm -hmm. The other one is a handy. Yeah. Guys, he's still alive, I think. The eyes are open. Yep. No, he's dead. Yep. Whew, can you go safe here? Yes. Wow, man, this was a smart guy. Get in here, man. So yeah. the shot goes. <laughs> how how he was in? He front was of shading you? this way. This way, so yes, it travels this way, this and it was in the high. Okay, so we give you a nice position. Broadside. Yep. Broadside. Hey, thank you so much. Thank you so thank much. Thank you. 
So guys, here you have it. A beautiful example of an anti-coasty island buck. This is a beautiful specimen, isn't it? Yes, he's big. And look at this neck. It it's is a getting big animal. bigger and bigger because of the rut. And a lot of people cannot believe and now understand why these deers deserve a place on their own record for sure. Yeah. And uh, I'm so happy, man. I'm so happy. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well, so we're gonna get this one ready and we have the big buck to go check it out. Yeah. Oh, here it is, Pierre. Look okay. at him. Oh, that was perfect. <laughs> this was what? 30 yards? 30 yards. Oh, man. Oh, he's a beauty, man. He's a beauty, eh? Yes, of course. Wow. I'm surprised how much smaller their, their faces are. Yep, yep. It's not a long nose, but look at the big, uh, big deer. Yeah, let's push him a little bit more to the side to see it better. Okay. <clears throat> So here you have it. We just retrieved my buck. What a beautiful animal. What a beautiful trophy in Anticoastal Island. Thanks to our guide, Martin, did a great, great job with those antlers over there rackling. This guy was fired up, was ready for a fight. He didn't like him here for sure. So he was just circling, circling around to get the win. But as luck we have for us, we were right there about 20 yards away and I was able to make a clean shot. He just died in his tracks.